Welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. So what are we going to do today? Today, we got two side by side. So let's go ahead and do this Assault in Progress and this Undiscovered. Now what city is that in, you might ask? That it looks like the Glen, maybe? Maybe it's, I don't know. Probably the Glen. We're going to call it the Glen. So let's get up out of here. Let's get to our vehicle up here. Oh, he ain't got nothing to say to us, huh? Come on, motor motorcycle. Let's get. All right, moving on. One point two kilometers. Yeah, buddy. Oh, 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 bumper cars. Get out of the way. Move, B. Get out the way. Get out the way, B. Get out the way. No, he didn't, just. Did you just? Please! Just don't make it hurt! Don't kill me! Well, you better stop running into me. That's what happens. Jack your car, you run up into me. I don't care if I was wrong or right. Back it up. There we go. Handling's a little better on this van. Not very fast. Oh, I almost got someone else to run over a pedestrian. Or civilian, or whatever you want to call it, an innocent. Go and to the right. 150 meters. Ooh, cop stuff to the left. I ain't worried about it. You want to jump out this car though? It's telling me to go up in here. So, let's see. Man, he's... What's going on here? Oh, it's leaving. New magazine detected. Message to user. Thanks, Chum. Uh, thanks, Chum. Let's go ahead and breach some protocols up in here. Let's see what Let's go ahead and do a contagion. We find you, no matter what. Yeah, give me, give me, give me. He's a robot, so we won't overheat him. Not bad. Sage and you. Got him. Oh, here's another robot as well. Give me a loop. Where are you at? Treaty! Very unwise! 
Yo, he done stripped and fell down. I know I am. I know. I will personally find you and bury you. Ooh, purple. No time to look. Engaging hostile! Uh, what can the list show me? Is there no end to this madness? There is no end to it. There we go. There we go. We're done. Anything else to pick up? Oh, yeah. A lot of stuff to pick up. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Not for you. I ain't got the bag, and what is, oh. What do we got, odors. Happy ball, happy thing. Can't do nothing with that. 90 meters that way, can we get up there somehow? That's the question. meters that way. Oh, yes, yeah, right. We just got done with the uh, assault in progress. So drones. Some docks could hand her to a fixer, spare parts, maintenance AV. Shards with update to G-58 Diane, down NT, max blades. Docks could hand to fixer, nanobodies, antibiotics, scent, blood cells. Yokorama, spare parts, AMI docks. Some forms of something could hand a fixer. Samples, who the F knows well. Could be viruses, toss them. Orders, target criminals, affiliated with the 6th Street Gang. Related operation, investigation into the drone interceptions. Night City, the Glen, number 443-2-CR. Priority high, code red. Scholar North, immediate attention. Dr. Zaya Lu. Got him. All right, moving on. Gun is reloaded. We have a gig. You need to retrieve a car. At the moment, a 6-3 car. See the attachment for more on the wheels. And its owner. All right, let's see about this. All right, gig type, search and recover. Upload a virus and retrieve Jake as his custom car. Broad street details. Why, it is some unwritten law of the world that every talented techie has as poor character. Only God knows. Jake Everett is one such genius among techies and an a-hole among S-heads. 15 minutes with a man and my barrel against his forehead. But good news is we found a way to get along. Jake's been a grease monkey for the 6th Street about two weeks now. Of course, I'm not on good terms with S6SG, 6th Street Gang, but I do grudgingly admire her patience. It is, after all, a virtue. Over that time, Jake's been doing a custom job on a car for me. His life's work, he says. Design the soft for it too. Remember, I said he has a S poor character. Yeah, well, he pissed off the wrong in Dodgers in the Sixth Street Gang and had to Delta and never looked back. Bottom line, Jake wants his precious car back. Go to the 6SG Auto Shop, upload the virus I sent you, and get it back for him. Don't scratch the ride and you'll get extra. We'll both be flush after this. Nice. I like being flush. Let's go ahead and quick save it. Anybody? Civilian. Be an If you suspect any 
All right, let's get in this protocol. Let's get in this guy's head right here. Oh yeah. So contagion. Let's do a weapon hitch. Oh gosh. He went down quick. Who is this? Recruit. We ain't got nothing. Okay, we got some people up over there. So far, they're going down pretty easy. Fun fact. The vast majority of murders are committed by men, just like you. <laughs> wow. They're gonna take out some peoples over here. Force that bad boy up. Strong arms. We get in the store. Thought I took out some people standing right over here. I don't know where they went to though. On one of their guns. Anyway, I think we done cleared out everybody. It's pretty nice and simple. So let's get us some loot now. Sound good to me. Oh, 55, 55, 1C. Yeah. E9, E9, E9. Got him. John, thank you. Thank you. We had an orange thing right over here. Oh, we got up in here. Legendary upgrade components. Uncommon components. It's good enough for me. Ooh, we got something up there as well. We got a conversation shard. Got a back door we came in. Shark, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Make sure I get everything. Even the top of this thing. Oh, and over. Upload the software to start the car. Hold on, Titus. I don't know what just happened. I tried to go through the window or something. Alright, what do we got? Legendary item components, components, gear shard engineering. I'll take it. Thank you. Here we are. Install the software. And done. Pretty easy. Pretty easy. the car. How are we going to get over that? Don't even know. Just, just do make sure the uh, 
Alright, we have collected everything. Do a quick save. Get Jake's car. Oh, we got more stuff over here. Thank you. I thought I had everything. But wait, there's something up here that needs my attention. Maybe it doesn't. Yes, yes it does. That weapon right there. So I need to get to this roof to get that extra money. There we go. There's that money at. Right here. There's that money. Then we're gonna get this car and then we out of here. Alright, so BD. 7A. Oh, this is off. Awesome. We're starting again. Yeah, they didn't say I had to do this quickly. Just said I had to do it. So. BD. Oh my goodness. Oh, and see. 55. Oh gosh. Awful. I'm out. That was an easy one, too. I can just figure it out. Take a few more seconds. Alright, we got this one. We got this one. Or maybe we don't. Um, let's see. BD, 7A, 1C, 55, BD, 2 out of 3, awesome. And down we go. Ouch. Give me some stems. Got them. So, don't scratch his ride, it's pretty ugly. This crazy fool. Go. Nobody's on the street, which means I can just go. Better get that bonus, too. Sorry, coppers can't be messing with you right now. Drive it. What's up with that UPS? There it is, there it is. Don't scratch the paint. Get out this bad boy. You thinking here still before I talk to him? You really saved my ass. I can't thank you enough. What now? You gonna sell this ride? What about the ride? You gonna fence it? Well, I have to sooner or later. Know a guy in Sacramento, a collector? He'll set me up for life. Oh, but for now, I'm taking her with me. Spruce her up a little more. Yeah. They'll be looking for you, buddy. Wouldn't stick around too long if I were you. Six Street are gonna be searching high and low for this beauty. I'm leaving town today. It's like Uncle Estevez always said. If you gotta choose between your ride and saving someone else's ass, always choose the ride. At least you know that a ride's never going to betray you. People, on the other hand. Yeah. 
you want me to leave the garage. I want you to leave the garage. Job complete. Life's work. Hit me up with some of that good good. Excellent. The car has reached its owner. Now the money will reach you. Good deeds are always repaid in kind. Closing the contract. Until next time. Boom. Money in the bank. Tell me what you think. Y'all got some, uh... What y'all doing up over there? Message to user. Thanks, June. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh! Tajin. I don't know what just happened here. Let's go ahead and put some contagion on them. Nothing much. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Who are these people? Cover me! And why are they I need cover! What you need is to back on up. Holy gosh. We are all up in this mess. Alright, well. Thank you, thank you. These people are coming from all over the place. You, another one by dust. Let's go ahead with contagion. I'm we got a police action going on here. Oh, I am too heavy to move. So let's go ahead and end this right here with this. I'm just going to fight off all these people. You know how it goes. All right, so the wall. What does a wall separate South California from its northern sibling? In USA, officials will tell you it's about ensuring freedom and safety. After all, the first thing that come to people's minds when they hear North California are dirty nomad families, illegal immigrants, and violent criminals of every stripe. They'll stay, say the wall's necessary for customs officers to prevent smuggling, and we're not just talking joints. Markets on the rise for trafficking included illegal cyberware assembled in the old hangars, biotech equipment, and precious items from older situations in Luma colonies. And I understand that I can even understand that when you cross the border, you will only waive your right to privacy from having your face scanned and registered to your car being tracked and heavily armed drones that transmit your real-time coordinates to a rapid response defense system in orbit, all on the off chance you're in fact a terrorist. For the split second that you go through the security gates, Militech or whoever won the bid to secure the wall, won't allow you to forget that you're in a potential war zone. And that's exactly what the wall is, a reminder. A reminder of how fragile peace and the independence of our city is. As a night citizen, I see the wall relatively frequently. Thanks to that concrete monstrosity, there's really no other way to describe it. I always bear the cost of peace of mind. Is that good? Bad? You decide for yourself. And then we got an archive conversation, Dolores and Jolica. 
I never do something like that, babe. You know what happen if I find out you're lying? Jake isn't even my type, so I promise you. Who even told you this BS? Doesn't matter. XOXO. So don't play with me, girl, or this one in a row. Got it? Of course, babe. Love you. Gosh, jealous much? Boom. All right, back to fight. Got him. As I get heavier and heavier, I'm still in combat for some reason because I forgot to do my assault rifle stuff. Ooh, we got a, a bigger one. Alright, so let's break some of these down. 30. Get me under that way. There we go. I can move again. We'll leave pistols for next time. Let's finish cleaning up the streets. And then I'm going to call it a day. Get out of here, shotguns. Just so we'll keep the pistols. This activity is done. What happened up around here? Look, dude. Y'all need to back up. Contagious. Fun fact the human body holds between five and seven. Let's over here, shoot. Is there no end to this madness? We got some eyeballs looking at us from somewhere. But I do believe we are all secured now. Awesome. Everything's picked up, and this is my official ending. So, next tick, y'all take care.